Okay, let's talk about the Duraflame. The Duraflame infrared pine log insert heater with the crackle sound, and this one is V39660. It's sale priced at $169.98, and it normally would be $217.87. Uh, we have it on five monthly payments of $34. The thing I want you to know is that Duraflame, I think we all know that name, Duraflame, and of course, they brought out the logs that we could put into our own fireplaces and burn. But what interesting, you know, what's interesting to me is that Duraflame started bringing heaters to QVC. To the tune of, we have sold more than two million Duraflame heaters here at the Q. And so people love them. They rave about them. This one is a little bit different. So sometimes we have the standing units. This one is really an insert, but it's going to heat. It's going to look great. It's going to have the sound of a crackling fire. It will give you the ambiance of a crackling fire in your home, all under one price tag of $169.98, and you can get it home for $34. Come on in, Emily Scott. Emily, this is beautiful, Hi. and I was blown away by this price. I mean, a lot of your <laughs> heaters are beautiful, and they absolutely are two, three, four, five hundred dollars depends upon what uh -huh. you're buying. Tell me kind of what this one is all about. Okay, so this is about making your dreams come true, is <laughs> what this is about. You know, we have these um, ideas when, our, when we buy our homes that our fireplaces are going to be cozy and our family's going to gather around and it's going to be warm. But the cold, hard reality is there are a lot of work. There are a lot of mess. There are some safety issues. You might want to have that chimney inspected from time to time. Well, Dora Flame created what we call the log insert. So what you're getting is an insert that goes inside your fireplace. This is not really a fireplace. This is actually a mantle prop that we bought to oh. make our a fireplace in our home. Interesting. But what it gives you is the look of everything you dreamed your fireplace could be. Mm -hmm. It is also the sound because we added a crackle sound this year. I don't know if you can hear that through my AirPods. And it is what you wanted your fireplace to feel like because we have given this one the infrared heating technology. Mary Beth, it's our best, most powerful, most efficient heating technology for about a 25 cents an hour. And without drying the air, this heater, yeah. when it's on, will heat a thousand square feet of your home. It's amazing. And you know, like you were saying too, and we're gonna talk about it, is that it doesn't add more dry heat to the house. So we'll explain that. But first of all, the size on this is about 21 inches wide and then about 13 inches high and about nine inches from front to back. So 21 yeah. wide, nine inches front to back and about 13 inches high. But here's what I wanted to t do is I wanna turn it around and all you have to do is be able to plug it in. All right, it yeah. just plugs into a wall outlet. Explain what all these things do right here. Yeah, absolutely. That's the control panel. First of all, you also get the remote control yes, of as course. well. Going mm -hmm. from bottom to top on the control panel, there's the on and off switch. So you just press that and it'll come on. The next button up is the volume control. There are three volumes of that crackle set. You know that crackle pop that a real yeah. fireplace has? Right. That's what that sounds like, soundtrack of cozy. The next button up is the flame adjust because you can dim the flame down if you want to take a little nap or you want to set the mood. You might want it just mm. a little less bright. Yeah. And that's the flames that are projected backward. The next button turns the heat on and off because what you can't do with your fireplace for sure, or maybe wouldn't want to do is lay a fire in July or August. Right. So we do this. You can turn the heat completely off and enjoy that incredible flame effect. And above that, I'm so glad you're showing this, Mary Beth. That is a thermostat. It is calibrated oh. from 62 to 82 degrees. That's where you set the temperature, but then you can use the remote to turn the actual heat on and off. Yeah. But that'll cycle on and off to maintain the temperature that you set. 
Wow. Okay. So I just flicked it on now. And here's yeah. my thing. Can we bring the lights down just a little bit? I want to show you some of the remote and you can show it too, but sometimes we can get more close um, shots here. But, mm -hmm. and also I want to definitely hear the crackling. So there you can see Fuck. it. Um, yeah. I know. Look at it. It looks so cool. I know. Okay. So here are the different Flame. Do I have to point it at any certain part? You're going to point it at, uh, at the side toward you. If you're looking straight at it, it's on the sensors on the right hand side. Okay, got so it. So you want to point that. It's like it's a TV. You have to point yeah. the remote at the TV to make it work. Exactly. And what you're seeing, look at the undulation of the light in the log. We made this to look like cracked pine. It looks like daddy went outside, cut some logs, brought them in and lit them. That looks like everything you wanted your glowing log ember bed to look like. It sits in what looks like a cast iron grate. And then the flames, which don't really show where you are because there's nothing behind you, but the flames are projected backward and you're going to see the flames on the back of your actual fireplace. Yeah. And if you're like me, I don't have a wood burning fireplace, but what I've learned from so many of our QVC viewers is they wanted one. So they got brought this home and created a fireplace. Like Carolyn, did you know Carolyn Gracie did that in her bedroom? Oh, I didn't she, know that. She did. That's she cool. bought a mantle. Right. Yeah. And then she put this in. Yeah. And talk about dreams come true, right? <laughs> a fireplace in your bedroom. Amazing. Now listen, I want to just show everyone. Okay, so watch my logs here. I'm going to show you the difference. So, okay, that's the highest light. That's the brightest, all right? And then there's there's five brightnesses. So now we're on number four. Okay, ready? I'm going to have you take a look at the whole thing here. Three, two, and one. Even on number mm -hmm. one, you can see, but it's not so bright, all right? Now, listen to this. There we go. There we go. I put it at the highest level now. You, it's like you can almost see a yeah. spark. You're not going to because right. it's just a soundtrack. You can yeah. almost see a spark fly into the middle of the family room, right? That's it's cool. just amazing, that soundtrack. Yeah. And that's where the heat comes out. And what I want to do is talk about the heating technology. Please. First, what I'll do is I'll... Yeah, it's incredible. Let me show you the power and performance. Yeah. Uh, let me turn on my heat gun here. I'm taking a temperature reading. If you can see that, I'm sorry. It's hard to yeah. see. Uh, 700. Um, yeah, yeah, we saw it there for a second. Um, it's 700. And let me okay. try to turn this off. Oh, yeah, there we go. There 739 we go. Degrees? degrees. Now, if I had an oven that was 700 degrees you wouldn't want to touch it right <laughs> no. now i'm never going to touch that grate because the grate does get hot but look what i can do with my hand yeah i know it. because the quality of the heat is different just like a scratchy sweater feels uncomfortable but a soft right. sweater feels good there's a difference in the quality of the heat infrared doesn't yeah. dry the air right. so there's a comforting it feels like sunshine and i'm sure yours is about as high as mine i probably got a heat reading right from the heating oh, yeah. but mm -hmm. let me take a temperature reading of what looks like fire and glowing logs right so i'm going to take it right from the top okay so oh there we go can you see yeah, 80 80 degrees yeah that what's up here this is all flame effect while this is heating your home and what dora flame wants you to do dora flame wants to be a supplemental heating technology you might not be able to turn off your heat i know i can't turn off my heat in december and january i've got to run my heat but what i can do is tap my heat back through the rest of my house yeah. heat the space i'm in now for an average cost of about 25 cents an hour to right. run this Amazing. in a time you know what's going on out there right with mm -hmm. heating costs now i can heat a thousand square feet of my home and listen right. you can take this with you i mean you can actually move it from room to room if you choose to do that or right. maybe leave it in your fireplace but it's a great option yeah. to heat your home it feels so good it's cold in yeah. the studio today 
and we typically keep it a little cooler because of the cameras and the lights and all that jazz. So this is feels so good. But imagine this in your fireplace. If you have a fireplace, and even if you don't, like you said, sometimes you can just go out and buy the actual wood fireplace mantle looking thing mm -hmm. that you know you pump up against the wall and then you put this in it. Here's the thing I want to remind everyone. 25 cents an hour to run approximately, depending upon where you live, but it is the most powerful and efficient heating technology called infrared quartz electric heating. And then you've got the remote control as well. There's five different, um, I want to say, settings of the lights. See what I'm showing mm -hmm. you? Like I just brought it down to the lowest light. Now I'm going to pop it up to number five, four, three, two, one one and then there's the crackling that you can turn yeah. off or you know <laughs> yeah. you can you have three different noise or uh, volume settings mm -hmm. you can run this without the heat if i yes. don't want the heat i can turn off the heat right yep there's okay. a button to turn it off and the thermostat as well because we want to enhance your home yeah, you just we want to bring a cozy and a comfort to your home just like that so you can run it with the flames or out with yeah. the heat without because think about those tough days in the summer. You know, we all have tough days all year long. You might not want the heat in the summer. You're never going to probably run, you know, light a real fire in the mm -hmm. summer. But there's something about that flame. There's something yeah. about adding a fireplace yes. feature. You know, my kids, two of them have left the nest. Darn them. And <laughs> when they come home, you know, I want things to be special. Yeah. I want it to be happy. This is like the American dream to have a fireplace. Mm -hmm. I want my family to cozy up, cuddle around. If you have a book club and you like this, you know, turn this on for the book yeah. club or if it's snowing outside. Mm -hmm. There's so many times that the fireplace, the flame effect just makes us feel cozy, yeah. makes us feel good. Comforting. And then you've got the look. And look at the flames, by yeah. the way, projected backward. And let me show you something real quick. So if you put this all the way back, which you can, you see how yeah. the flames kind of dim down. I say pull it all the way out and look at how yeah. that flame blooms. That's amazing. Really comes to light. And all great? with the touch of a button on a remote control. That's even better. Yeah. <laughs> so even I better. can turn it off. I can turn it on. This is such a great item from Duraflame. Emily Scott, thank you so much for joining us today. Such a, such a pleasure, Mary Beth. Thank you so My much. My pleasure. You too. Bye-bye now. And bye -bye. Monifa, come on over. Let's have some little fireplace. Oh, and it. you've got the joy of toys. Mm -hmm. And I have four little grandkids that I've been buying toys from <laughs> QVC for. Um, but anyway, how are you doing? I'm good. And I agree. I've been buying toys for my little great nieces and nephews, too. Oh, wonderful. I got them scooters. Scooters. And oh. a couple of things coming up this good next idea. hour. Good idea. Good. So stay with Monifa. I'll see you again tomorrow right here. Same channel. Uh, I'll start at 11 a.m. on QBC2. I'll see you. Have a great afternoon. Thank you. You too. Bye, everyone. Well, I'll see you soon, everyone. Yeah, don't go away.